Hi, Story Gordon here. Welcome. As an advocate of ghosts, but a premise that speaking is a performing art, committed to Campbell's assertion that artists must master their tools, subscribing to art and view that a speaker's responsibility is making a point so the audience understands it, then elocution must be the first fundamental of speaking. Any questions? What did I just do? I delivered what I consider to be a carefully crafted script in the worst possible way. I made four points, made references to Bill Gove, Joseph Campbell, Ron Arden, come to the conclusion that elocution is the first fundamental of public speaking. I did it for a reason. I'll do it again in a better way. As an advocate of Gove's premise, speaking is a performing art. Committed to Campbell's assertion that artists must master their tools. Subscribing to Arden's view that a speaker's responsibility is making a point so the audience understands it. Then, elocution must be the first fundamental of speaking. Any questions? I have one. Why? Why don't more speakers work on elocution? It's very simple. If you go to the OED, the Oxford English Dictionary, it defines elocution as the skill of clear and expressive speech, especially of distinct pronunciation and articulation. If you go back 120 some years, you'll find this beauty, the science and art of elocution published in 1878. I think he was an engineer, Frank Pennell. He diagrammed, outlined, organized elocution so carefully that it's easy to identify what's important and how to improve it. Elocution basically has two parts, the voice, and the body. The voice is primarily used for articulation, pronunciation, enunciation, emphasis, pausing, and other techniques. But there's more than just the voice. There's the body, especially the face, As Ron Arden used to say, use your face. Why in the heck aren't you using your face? The face transmits so much information unspoken. And your hands. So that's it. Elocution is basically the effective use of your voice and body. Especially your face and hands. That's it. There's not much more to say, except work on your elocution. So many speakers spend no time working on how they say what it is they've decided to say. They speak too softly. They speak too fast. They pause where pauses are a distraction. They load up their speaking with ums and ahs and errs. Work on your elocution. It's the first fundamental. How do you do it? You're an artist. It's your responsibility. You can ask for feedback from friends. You can tape your material and be a tough critic. Search the internet for elocution exercises, elocution lessons. 
There is so much available, free. The only reason your elocution is not improving is because you're not working on it. If you're a serious speaker, you work on your speaking every day. Elocution is the first fundamental. And I encourage you to think about where you're weak. Work on that by improving the weakest part of your speaking. The overall effect will also improve. If you want more of my views on speaking, there are more than 175 video clips on my YouTube channel, Story Gordon. Drop by if you like it, keep coming back. If you want to be alerted when I put up new videos, subscribe. But whatever you do, if you're a serious speaker, master elocution. This is Story Gordon saying, thanks for stopping in. I hope you'll come back soon.